afternoon Sarji family welcome back to another vlog here in Turkey Istanbul I got Shadia right here hi. we got Rania right here hi Rania say hi say hi to the vlog there we go hello we're actually at this aquarium park here in Istanbul we're gonna take you guys along we're gonna vlog a little bit here and maybe go do some shopping and then some eating because eating is a big deal here in Istanbul Shadia's hungry let me just see how I look do I look crazy today you oh, look, look crazy. you look crazy but beautiful crazy <laughs> If you didn't look crazy, I don't want you. I don't want a normal person. I want a crazy person because you have to match me. So I have no idea where we're going. I, my driver actually just dropped us off and we're going with the flow, I guess. All right, we're at the aquarium right now. <laughs> Rania, are you ready to see some fish? Oh, she wants the vlog camera, hello. Can we see those pretty smile? She's so cute. All right, let's go see some fish and let's go see some penguins and stuff. Two minutes into fish and chill and Shadi already wants a snack. <laughs> we'll share it, right? Ooh, yummy. What are these flavors? They I don't so know. Good. It looks the good. The blue and white one looks good. Heck yeah. They have lemonade too. All right, two seconds into the aquarium and we're already sitting having ice cream. <laughs> we just needed a snack to get us started before we know. You guys know me, I don't like seeing animals all caged up or whatever, but I know this aquarium here, they take really good care of the whales, the fish and the shark. I don't know if there's any whales to be honest. And I, I did a, penguins. Yeah, I hate places like Marineland. Like I did a video on Marineland, I haven't released it yet, but that's because they abuse animals there. Places like this, they're known for having like, you know, a presence with animals where they take care of them. They take these animals that are injured or hurt and they, it basically nursed them back to health in places like this. So I want to go and see these whales or sharks if they, I don't think they have whales. I keep saying whales, like sharks and other fish life that are in here. And I hear they have a real mermaid. So let's, let's see, let's see man. Ronnie, you want some ice cream? Ice cream? First Turkish ice cream? Let's try it. It's gelato. Gelato. Ooh. Wait, wait, wait. Ronnie gets the first bite. Ronnie has to get the first bite. Oh, this is for her? Yep. There you go. <laughs> she wants to fight you for it now. There you go. Don't get yourself there. <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> she likes it. <laughs> how could ahead, she not? It. How could she not like ice cream? Look at that face. Oh. Alright, you want me to try it? I'm gonna try it. I mean, it's probably just normal. <laughs> That's actually really good. Is it? Yeah, what does it taste good. like? It tastes like cotton candy and caramel at the same time. Really? It smells yummy. It's literally like cotton candy and caramel at the same time. You should feed them some. You guys want some? This is Omar's thing, by the way. He feeds the camera in the vlog, so shout out to Omar. <laughs> <laughs> Mommy, you like it? Oh, is yeah, it good? Mommy definitely likes it. Oh, oh. Mess over here. She definitely be liking it. It's a rainy day here in Istanbul, guys. Um, we're on a different side of Istanbul, not like we're, we're staying. It took us about 40 minutes for our driver to drive us out here. I did rent a car, but I also rented a driver because I've been very stressed. You guys all know this, ever since we got here, I've been like under a lot of stress driving in this place. Like, it's giving me anxiety. The people that drive here are far worse than the Dominican Republic. Like, Dominican Republic driving is actually not bad compared to here. It's just crazy madness out here. And honestly, every time we go out anywhere, I can't focus on vlogging. I can't focus on what we want to do. And it's put me under a lot of stress so I hired a driver to drive my rental car yeah he's waiting in the car we're gonna go in there and he's getting paid pretty well too so I'm, I'm just thankful that I was able to find one in such a short amount of time let's go see Free Willy I look like a Helga right now oh what Helga. you look like you're from Germany with that hair I like it though this is like so like good and stretchy <laughs> when I told you to feed them I told you to feed them this is what I meant by being like, Holy crap, this that's cash. a big amount. Nah, bro, they didn't earn it. Hold on, chill, chill, bro. I'm <laughs> just joking, I'm just joking. All right, ice cream girl, here we go. We're about to enter the Black Sea. <laughs> no, literally, it says Black Sea right there. Whoa, look at this, Rania. There's a whole pirate ship for you over here. Oh, look at all the fish. There's like salmon over there. 
I think that's salmon. Whoa, we're in a pirate ship. <laughs> so cool. Oh my God, that looks like, are those salmon? That's a, uh, wait, what is that? That's uh, a sturgeon. We got a rainbow trout. We got a Russian sturgeon. We got a random kid over here. And we got a, this one here. I don't know what that's called. Look at this though. Ooh, those are so Hey, fishy, fishy, fishy. Bro, look at the fish. You see the fish? This is your, literally your first aquarium ever. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. <laughs> we don't want to let Rania loose. She's going to jump in the fish over here. Whoa. Hey, fishy, fishy. Man, you would probably taste good. Yeah, you would probably taste good too. You would taste good. I don't know about you. You're kind of looking down. So yeah, you're way too small for me. So these are, these are sturgeon. And sturgeon are known to be really, really big fish. Like these things are massive. Holy moly, that's a massive fish, wow. So cool. Well, look at its teeth, it's actually really ugly. Yeah. <laughs> You're so ugly, Mr. Fish. <laughs> Ronnie, you see the fish? Whoa, <laughs> you see the fish? No. <laughs> you see the fish? They kind of look like sharks from up top, but the, these are actually sturgeon. They get way bigger than this, by the way. Yeah, those are like the rejects, I think. That's what I'm gonna call them. <laughs> they put them in like a reject pile in like this little tiny pool over there. Yeah. Oh, I thought there was two of them. It's just a reflection. No, it's one. Oh man, look at the mouth on you. Look at the mouth on you, mister. Look at these ones, Shadia. Whoa, not gonna lie, I kinda wanna jump in there and go for a swim. See, this is the type of fish I was trying to catch in the Dominican and spear and like trying to eat But you know, I was only able to find like the poisonous ones. Whoa, yo, this is a nice pool I want to jump in that. It's so inviting. I like you guys know I love swimming This is like really oh, look at how the display is in the back You have all like the big statues and like buildings from Istanbul. So check it out These are these are fish that you find in the Bosphorus River like here in Istanbul if The weather is good. We might be taking a river tour and these fish these big ones, they live in the actual Bosphorus River. So that's pretty interesting. Wow, fishy, fishy. Oh, what the hell do we have here? Looks like there's something really massive in here. Oh, it's sharks. Ooh, we got sharks over there. Dude, this is so cool. Shady, we got a shark, look at the shark. Look at the shark right there. Wow, that's a big shark right there. Dang. And there's also like other fish in there too. That's a pretty big pool, not gonna lie. <laughs> She's scared. Whoa. You see that? Look, stand over here. Whoa. So cute! Wow! She's so excited to see all the fish over here. <laughs> She's yelling at the boy. <laughs> She's literally yelling at the kid. Yeah. Whoa! <laughs> here, fishy, fishy. I'm Rania and I want to eat you. That one's smiling at Rania. Really? The red one? Look at this one. Oh, Show her this one. Look at all the fish. Rania's first time in the aquarium. Look right here. Wow, look at this fish over here. She's excited. There's a shark down there. Yeah, I've gotten. Oh, oh that's a big one. Oh my god, that's yeah, a you can't see big shark. Over here, he'll come over here, but that's a massive shark. Ryan, look. Look up. Oh, we got the stingray over here. Look at this. It's a tiny one. <laughs> look at the tiny stingray. Whoa. Where'd that shark go? Wow. 
Look at those how they're uh, swimming together. Yeah. It's like the mama teaching the baby. Yeah, so cool. Wow. It, there's like literally a whole wildlife it's under like, here. It's a whole ecosystem yeah. of fish. Look at the little mini ones. Yeah, wow, look at all the fish up in the ceiling now. We're in this other area over here and there's like fish up in the ceiling. It'd be cool if they had like a shark up there. Ryan, look up top. I don't know if it's the glass, but that's a freaking eel. Look how massive it is. That white thing under the, the wood. I don't know how we got under there. But those are eels right there. That's so crazy. That's crazy. That, that's an eel here and that's an eel there too. Hey Molly, I had no idea we were literally on the water coming to this aquarium. We're literally at the ocean. What the hell? It's really not even one way. Yeah, it's so calm, right? Like it's good for diving, even though it's raining outside. This is so cool. I, I did not know we were right on the ocean. What are the odds of that? Then again, this is like a sanctuary for like fish, I guess. I don't know. Whoa, check this out. There's like a whole ass aquarium. Fish right above you, right on top of you. I wonder if this, it's too small to have sharks in there. What's going on, Shaggy? <laughs> Shaggy, you're never satisfied with your photos. No. You're never satisfied with your photos. Hey, look at this fish, it's chrome. What kind of wrap you got on there, bro? It's It's like a chrome fish in there. This is a, what the hell is this one? This is a pretty big one. Ooh, look at this one, Shaggy. I'm trying to eat you, my boy. Oh man, we're going into the North Pole. Just as I suspected, no actual penguins, Shaggy. They got the fake, the fake mini polar bears. Nah, they never had any. It's clickbait. Anyways, look at this. There's a cave here. This is this is supposed to be like the Mediterranean side. Pretty cool. Four. I have never seen an eel. I never knew they were this big. That's crazy. These are freaking massive, man. Look at this. These are these are really big eels. Look, there's one in the pot. Its head's coming out of the pot right there. Oh my god. You see that? Wow. Yeah, that's so cool. There's some really big fish in here. It looks like they're in like a tiny tank, but it's it's actually big behind the, the rocks and it just goes into the whole other side. But I guess they just like hanging out here by the light. Look at this. Oh, you big one. That's a massive one. Where on earth has Shadia? Shadia, you're cheating on me? I caught you in 4K. What the hell are you doing? That's like Shadia. How dare you? What does he have that I don't have, huh? A club? I can get 10 of those clubs. Abs? I got abs, they're just under a little bit of meat. That's all. Some weird ears. I may be lacking in the giant department, but goddamn Shadow, you know. Can't believe I caught my wife cheating on me. I'm no, sorry. no, no. Sorry. No, we're done. I love you. We're done. We're done. <laughs> Whoa, this one's a really big one. Really huge display full of fish over here. Wow, there's some big fish right there. Oh my god, dude, I would love to just go in here with my spear gun and just start spearing some fish for dinner. God dang. Most people would just be like, oh, this is cool fish. And I'm just like, oh, my, my dinner. There goes my dinner right there. Literally swimming away. And we have entered the shipwreck of doom. <laughs> Look at all this. This is cool. A tunnel? Hell no, I ain't going in there. Oh, you come out that way. Hell no, I ain't going in no tunnel. Wait, no, you don't come out from here. Where do you come out from? Oh, you come out from here. Yeah. <laughs> Should we go in? No, there's no way. Oh yeah, you do. It goes all the way in. <laughs> Alright guys, we are going through the tunnel of smelly, derp, dirty kids diapers. And we're gonna come out on the other side. <laughs> I really wonder what Rhonda would do in that tunnel. I think she's too young for it still. Yeah, I think she'd get comfortable. Oh, we got some sharks over here. Whoa. Wow. Okay. All right, y'all just just do nothing all day. You just sleep. I love how they just like park beside each other and they just sleep here. Oh, we're about to see some shark action. That is actually the funniest thing I've ever seen. There's a Christmas tree in the water and there's a fireplace over there. In the <laughs> That's actually hilarious. Huge. Those are really big fish. The fact that there's actual fish in the Christmas tree as a decoration. Yeah, until they get hungry and start eating. That one's got some big scars on it. I think those are tunas. Yeah, those are tunas over there. Yeah, those are big tunas. Tunas can get even bigger than that. I, they're just chilling in the tree. Like, that's so awesome. Whoever thought of that is a pretty good idea. Oh, my God. That's a big one. Whoa. That's a big old shark. Jesus. I love the fact that he's not just eating all the other big fish in there. He's probably well fed. I mean, he looks fat. That is a big, big boy right there. Really big boy.
I would honestly, if they were to give me the opportunity to swim down here, I would actually do it. Whether there's sharks or not, I would literally come down here. Oh, there's another shark. Never mind, I changed my mind. Look at look at how that little fish is following that shark right there. Oh my god. So the, that fish underneath the shark actually follows it everywhere and it eats its food that it, like comes out of its mouth. You see the sharky shark? All right, that's uh, snack number two for the day. Wait, let me shine some light on this. <laughs> All right, we got snack number two so for the good. day. It's Belgium white chocolate with milk chocolate. Ooh. Strawberries underneath, and I think bananas if I'm not mistaken. Man, that looks yummy. Let's destroy it right now. So colorful in here. Look at this, you guys. Wow. Finding Dory. <laughs> Looks like they do have penguins after all. They're in this like dark enclosure over here. Look at there's one right there. Whoa, that's so cool. I've never seen a penguin swim before. We're in the Amazon rainforest part of this place. I think these are piranhas right here. Yeah, those have to be piranhas. Whoa, it's so, like misty and foggy in here. This is so cool. It's like we just transformed and went to like a jungle. This is the type of fish you find in the Amazon rainforest in the rivers. It is raining because look, they've created a, a type of like climate in here. That's pretty cool. Look at these big boys over here. In the dark waters. That's how the waters would be in the Amazon rivers. Oh, so it looks like a catfish right there. Yeah, it's definitely a catfish. And then you got these guys. These are massive. They're bigger than they look on camera. Way bigger. So cool. I've been really like fascinated with fish lately. Like I watch a lot of fish videos on YouTube. And uh, you know, these, are, these guys are cool. So that right there is a poisonous frog. Yep, definitely a poisonous one right there. So many fish in here. Literally looks like an entire uh, jungle here. Whoa, that's a capybara. These things are huge. I've never seen one in real life. I don't know if they had these here. Obviously, they have to go with the uh, like Amazon forest theme, right? So they brought in a capybara. Look at this thing. All right, so these are piranhas. Those other ones weren't piranhas that I thought they were at the beginning. These were actual piranhas right here. So cool. So dangerous to these things. They're so aggressive. All right, so jumping into the night, we're in this other area that I've never been to. It's really pretty out here, actually. There's this like really good kebab place that we're gonna have some Turkish kebab here, and uh, we're gonna go inside and do just that. I can't wait. Whoa, this place is really cool, really fancy. They got the Christmas decorations up. We're about to order some food. They got lots on their menu. Oh my God, look at this fresh bread right here. Coming in hot from the oven, guys. Check that out. That's so cool. Thank you. Whoa, that smells so good. That actually smells really, really, really delicious. We haven't even ordered food yet. God damn, that smells good. I can't get over how good it smells. We just got our first appetizer right here. This is called kibbe. It's raw meat. We eat this all the time. They call it something Yeah, they call it, they call it something else, but we call it kibbe in Lebanese. It's actually delicious. If you ever get a chance to eat this, try it out. It's really good. It's basically raw meat with some herbs and some parsley and uh, some spices and also some burgul. I'm going to be the first one to test this out. Oh yeah, spicy. Mmm, that's actually, oh wow, that's so good. It's spicy though. Good? Oh my goodness, they did not just hit me with this mixed grill. It smells so good too, it looks insane. It smells good. Shadi, I got some chicken over here. We also have some more food coming. We got some french fries for right now, which I'll probably finish off. I'm gonna get fat on this trip, but you know what? This is what you come to Turkey for. You come for the amazing, amazing food. They literally do have amazing food here. So this right here is called the lahme bajin, or in Turkish you say lamachun, <laughs> lamachun. And it's just basically a meat pie, very thin bread, and uh, it's got some herbs and some tomatoes in it, and then you squeeze some lemon on it like that. Mm, I'm sorry, Shadia, I got it all over you. <laughs> all right. Bon appetit. All right, I'm gonna be the, the test subject over here. The victim. Oh my god, it's so freaking thin. All right, here we go. Is it good? Like, I'm waiting for you to say something. Bro, it's heavenly. You can't just take one bite. It's, it's, it's so crunchy and crispy, and the meat inside is perfect. I love it. You can't have Turkish barbecue basically without the Iran yogurt. This stuff is heaven, man. If you've never tried it, you gotta try Iran yogurt. This stuff is actually made here in house. We have not been doing too well with this. What do they call it? Jet lag? We're on our third day, and guys, let me tell you, the second 7 p.m. rolls around, we're dead tired. We're like dying. It's 9 p.m. right now, and like, we're just dying. Like, we wanna go to bed, man. I hate that. Like, I've never had jet lag before because I've never taken long flights. 
like we did to actually get here and it's just it's just so annoying you coming in mommy <laughs> we're all just done we're gonna go to bed right now and i'll probably say goodbye to you guys tomorrow morning or something i don't know I'm so tired. let's go to bed <laughs>